An Ordinary, Episode 51. My Servian's House at Night. Okay. Books being dropped. Miss. Your father will be leaving for his trip tomorrow. This is the work he assigned you for tonight. I'll be back to pick it up in the morning. Please don't disappoint us again like last time. Have a good night. She's not supposed to sleep? Wait. She's leaving. She just shoves off the books. Does she stand up? John, you can get yourself out of anything. You'll fight your way out, love your way out, or you'll just run away. If you can do all that as a cripple, then what's stopping me? She's gonna revolt? Okay, it's daytime. On her couch on the laptop. Good morning, miss. Oh, there's back. I'm here to pick up your assignments. Have you completed them yet? Nope. Please finish within an hour. Actually, that won't be possible, considering I haven't touched any of it yet. And why is that? Because I didn't want to. Miss, it's not about what you want. Except you're going to put some laptop. Your parents gave you a task. It's your duty to complete it correctly and on time. If your mother finds out, it's fine. What's up? I'm going to speak with her directly. So you don't need to worry about explaining anything to her. Okay, she's leaving. Grabs on her shoulder. Stop. Please let me know what you wish to say. And I will relay your message to her. I start shining. There's no need. In She's freezing. But Miss Serafina. She's black and white. Okay, she's going. Okay, she's in front of the door. Think about John dropping the cake. And then bullying him. And at the library. If you can do it, then so can I. She the doorknob and she's shaking. Her mom's sitting on her couch, looking at some papers. I click, looks up. Mom, Serpina, I thought I told you to get rid of those hair extensions. And fix up your jacket. What are you doing out of your room? You should be working. Mom, I'm not doing those assignments anymore. Hmm? I don't like the way I'm treated here. I won't be able to walk around freely and dress how I like. If she puts on the teacup, huh, puts down papers. Don't act so selfish. Stop whining about such trivial things. Be grateful for everything you've been, uh, we've given you. Unlike everyone else, you were born privileged. The path to success has already been laid out for you. Don't ban your responsibilities. Like what your failure of a sister did. Now, go back to your room. You know, I finally realized why Leela ran away from here, huh? This place is cold and lifeless. Everything is object-driven. It's unbearable. You always call her the failure. Probably because you don't want to admit that your own actions are to blame for what happened. Oh. But I found a face. Don't you dare speak to me that way. Oh, raise her hand. Gonna slap her? Oh, smack. What? Stop the wrist. How did you stop me? Oh, she's freezing her. Because I'm fasting you, obviously. Huh? Freeze. Serafina, stop. Unfreeze me, this instant. Not till you hear what I have to say. I want a plane ticket back to Wellston. By the end of tomorrow. I can't stand living here another day. So I'm going back early. Please reactivate my phone and credit cards. I'm packing up all my stuff tonight. Crazy child. You're not going anywhere. Actually. I'll be leaving no matter what, but how I go is completely up to you. Cross her arms. Choose wisely. What would others think of you if both your daughters ran away from home? What are the chances of having two failed children? Maybe the mother is at fault here. You're threatened to run away? You couldn't survive a week on your own. Mom, either buy me a ticket or I'll find my own way back. Okay, uh, I'll let you think on that. Oh, and I only fly first class. After all, I am your daughter. Serafina! Like leaving. Shut the door. Ooh. That's the little door. I did it. Think about John getting thumbs up. I broke free. Bonus, okay. Oh, mom. Marisa. Time manipulation. 7.4. Okay. 
Her speed is like maxed out. Power and trick are high. Uh, recovery is mid. And defense is low. Hmm. I wonder where her father has. Okay. Episode 52. Get back at school. Daytime. Okay, the two. Red hair and orange with the black undercut. Okay. Well, Stin, top story. Students cause bomb threat at Koro Mall by Namis. Ah, uh, what the heck? Maru cool didn't get chosen. Bumps him. Hey, at least you technically still made it onto the front page. Remy, Blake, Neeson, please report to the main office. Uh oh. Are they in trouble? Okay. Tap. Oh, the principal's office, okay. I'm sure you three know why I called you here. Is everything written in this article true? Not entirely, sir. It doesn't tell the complete story. We tried to chase after the culprit, but we were mistaken for the ones who set the bomb. There was a misunderstanding, but we cleared things up with mall security. Good. At least you did that. Let me remind you, Wilson has a very unique environment. Here, you have the freedom to exercise your abilities, as you wish. Because the damage is are easily repairable. But the moment you step off campus, you need to be more careful. Wilson's reputation and and others' safety are on the line. You are three of the most powerful students. What you decide to do out there could significantly impact those around you. So the next time any of you run into a special situation, don't act impulsively. Think about the consequences of your actions before making a move. Is that understood? Yes, Headmaster. Okay. Hmm. That wasn't so bad. I thought we were going to get pummeled. Yeah. And can you believe that man actually reads the school papers? I wonder if he likes my articles. Okay. Yo, I'm hungry. Let's grab a bite to eat. Hmm. Okay, she's thinking. Yeah, let's go. The events in the paper happened only two days ago. And on a weekend, no less. How could someone from our school get a hold of the news so fast? Hey, Remy, you coming? Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's odd. Could it be that someone's been watching us? Uh oh. Okay. We have Arlo on top of the roof. Hmm. Cree? Creek? Is that John coming up? Ah, here we go. Yep, John. Hey, Arlo. Fancy seeing you again. Is Binder. So, do you enjoy the mango boba? Check it out. My papers don't fly all over. Swing around? No. What? What are you doing up here again? Sigh. So just taking a breather before my cl next class. Take it somewhere else. This place is off limits. How many times do I have to tell you? Huh? Please. Okay. If me being here really bothered you, you would have thrown me off ages ago. Looks over. Hmm. Is he gonna do it? So, you sure come up here a lot? Yeah, it's quite here. I can clear my mind. And I don't have to bother with all the nonsense below. Okay, he's thinking about his old school. I'm alone. Yeah, I hear ya. Look down, peek. Okay. Hmm. Ah, oh, shoot. I forgot I still have class. Oh, wait. First, you got any plans after school? Not really. I might run some errands. Mind if I tangle along? I don't really have much else to do. Okay. Actually, yes, I do. Ah, oh, come on. I'll help you out. Huh? What kind of person does errands alone? Anyway, I gotta go. Let's meet at the school gates after class. Be there or be square, please. Okay. How does Serafina put up with this guy? He's actually waiting, okay? Beep, beep. Whoa, you actually waited. Don't mind me. All right, then. Where are we headed? So what are they going to do? Episode 53. They're on a train? Rumble, rumble. Huh? We've been on this train for a while now. 
Harlow. Uh, we're going out pretty far. What kind of errands are you running exactly? He smirks. You'll see when we get there. Okay. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, okay. Okay. Clean touchdown. Sabrina's out of the gate. Okay. The number you re have reached is currently unavailable. Please hang up and call again later. Hmm. I guess he still hasn't got a new phone yet. Okay, she gets in a taxi. Alright, miss. We're two. Wilson, please. Okay. Go through the turntables. Hey, so, where exactly are we right now? This is Wilson's turf war location. What? You took me to turf wars? Um, I don't know if you noticed, but... Put the stands up. I'm really built for this kind of environment. You know, because I'm crippled. Huh. I thought we were going to go grocery shopping or something. Relax. No one's fighting. Is he, is he going to leave him? I'm just meeting up with some people here. Besides, with me around, what could possibly happen to you? Come on, let's go. Okay. Huh. This isn't a trap. Okay, the walk-in. Uh oh. Oh, there you are, Arlo. We're starting to think you weren't going to show up. John, some, those two. They're the ones who broke my phone. Smashed. What are they doing here? Mind tell me what's going on? Hold on. Stay there for a sec. They can jump him. Arlo. Okay. Smirking. Nod. Lock him down. Uh oh. What? Her hands are growing red. She, they're both rushing him. Uh oh. Black? Think about the girl. I trusted you. She's coming with him. Rip. Oh, slashing him. Ah, on the arm. Spleen out. Arlo. What the heck are you? Dude blasting with some purple energy. Boom. Thank God, he's on the ground. Thud. Oh. She's got the blades on his neck. Uh oh. Surprise. Uh. Uh oh. Episode 54. Previously on Unordinary. Okay. Hey, Arlo. We're going out pretty far. What kind of errands are you running exactly? You'll see when we get there. And they meet, and they come after him. Yeah, he's on the ground. Got her nails at him. Surprise. Okay. Ooh. Getting his head slammed on the ground. Bam. Hands behind his back. Arlo. Oh, how rude of me. I haven't introduced these two yet. Uh, this is Ventus and Miley. I believe you met before. They're the ones who broke your phone. Uh, how do you know about that? Whoa. You really are oblivious. I'm the one who told them to do it. What? You never wondered why I was willing to tolerate you? Why would someone of my status associate myself with a cripple like you? I already warned you, didn't I? I had no intention of ever being your friend. In fact, I quite despise you. Oh, why? Hi, John. Meet me at the fields after school. I have something to show you. Claire. Okay. Scratch his head. All I wanted was to be ordinary. To be able to get along with others. Okay, he meets them. Claire. But why? All the rest of the kids? Why is it that when I finally get what I want? John, the real reason I called you here. All of it turns out to be fake. Yeah. What am I doing wrong? The real reason I brought you here today is to put you down. They're not going to kill him. Yeah, you're such an eyesore. It's time you start acting like the peasant that you are. You're not part of this conversation. F off. Okay. Bam, it's on the ground. What do you say to me? Just how much will it take to break you? 
There's no one around for miles. So we have all the time in the world to ingrain this lesson in your head. You're completely powerless. Everything that you've experienced in the last few weeks was by my will, saving the suspension. Your limited contact with her. Your rescue from those four mid-tiers. And everything and every encounter you've had afterwards. You can make mad. They were all facilitated by me. Uh oh. You have control over nothing. Class? I came to Wellston to turn over a new leaf. In class? I wasn't selfish. I didn't boast about my power. I didn't hurt anyone. How? How did things end up like this again? Monster! No. All those times? Who? Each altercation? Smash! Wham! Can beat up? Arlo? I'm not the monster. Got nothing to say? Still processing? They are. Oh. Why don't we help him out? Oh, she's gonna with the nose. Melee. Snap. Arlo! Whew. Black woman around him? Is that his power? Huh? They're both being pushed back? What the? Screech? He's back up? What's going on? Shivering? Uh oh. Got black eyes? You son of a woman. Eyes are glowing. Uh, Amber? His black hands? Oh. Got him. Okay. Episode 55. Screech? Okay. Being sent back. He's up. What's going on? Shivering? Oh. You son of a woman. Smirking. Is that? Okay. Dude's being scraped back. What is this? I thought he was a cripple. Just looking at Arlo. Arlo is still smiling. So things must be going as planned. Are you sure? Okay. It, no, they're growing? Huh? He's dashing. Arlo? Okay, what's Arlo gonna do? Ooh, she gets in the way. Fuck. Okay. He has the same bill as me. Wait, what? What are the chances? Huh? Get out of my way? Slash at her? Shock. Ugh. Go on the side. Uh oh. Huh? Who said you could interfere? Going after her? Melee! Got the wind? Okay. Whoosh! Send the flying back? Got him. He's up there? Wait, what? This, my wind. Wait, what? Comes down, swirl, tap. You. That barely did anything to him. Somehow, he's using both our abilities. Is it like, he can use the abilities that were put on him? Be careful. He's dangerous. But if we work together, we can beat him. Can you use more than one ability at once? Can you still fight? Yeah. Don't worry about me. Okay. He's super speeding her. Okay. She got the claws out. Yeah. Go on. Down. Trash. Blades. Ooh. Two. Wait. He sent him flying? Blades of wind? That's not part of Ventus's kit. Jump. Ooh. Huh? He goes through him. Ah, oh, bam! Ventus! Uh oh. Coming through the throat. Dodge out of the way. Bring the wind. Vroom. Boom! Sends her flying. Cuff, cuff. Oh. Melee! She's in there. Hang on. I'll catch you. Come on, come on. Ooh! Stab in the arm. Uh oh. Alright, John. You won. You're stronger than both of us. I'm sorry for what I did, okay? Please, if she falls from the height, she might shut up and kick him back. Please, just let me save her, darn it. You can do whatever you want with me later. Please, just let me go. 
She's fallen? She might not survive the, the fall. I set you up. She, boom! She slams. Stabs him. Ooh, she's broken. Pulls out the blade from him. Stripping blood. Uh, he's looking back. So this is what you've been hiding all along. This is the true John. Okay, we have bonus. We have Ventus Whirlwind. 3.8. Uh, they're all mid. Okay. Yeah. Bunch of threes. His speed's a four. Coverage two. Melee Demon Claw. 3.8. Okay. Bunch of threes. Power five. Recovery two. John. Question mark, question mark. Ooh, trick 10. Uh, power 7.5, speed 6, defense 3, recovery 2. Okay. Dang. Is he going to have a barrier? Okay. Episode 56. Okay, are though. He's coming at him. Locks. Okay. Just push it aside. Flame blades. Huh. Maybe just staring at each other. Bring out more blades. Swoosh. Blocking. Not getting hurt. Oh, whirlwind around him. Okay. He's dashing in. Hey, John. You think by extracting my vision, by throwing a bit of wind at me, snap. You'll give me to use my barrier? Huh? But you kind of already used his barrier. Or is there like a time limit to when he sees it? Slash them? Swing. How's he not affected? You have to try harder than that. Psh. Whoosh. It's levitating. Okay. Is it like a... Like, um... A duration? Send... Oh, he's just charging him from the sky? Ah... Uh... He's ripping his shirt. Once I activate my barrier, I'll most likely be able to use it. I only have one shot to take him down. Sides are blue. Glint. Wham! Hits him. And John's arm is bleeding. Cough. Oh, he's bleeding too. Crack. He cracked it. Going in. Pow! Since John flying. Oh, he's scratching. Slides. Ha. Ha. His arms turn back. Drip. He's in a barrier. Crush. Shrinking. Shrink, shrink. What? Stopping it? Using his own barrier to stop mine from crushing him? Ooh. He changed. Okay. Defense and trick are top. Uh, power is uh, probably eight. Speed is a little lower. Recovery is still low. Wham! He's beating on the barrier. Whack! Wham! Bam! Thanks to my ability. He's barely uh, taking reflective damage. At this rate. Bam! He'll break out. Ooh, got the cracks. Bam! Cough. Ooh, it's hurting him. Crash. It's coming at him. Oop. Whirlwind. Boom! Wait, what? Did he... Go through him? Okay, went by him. Boom! Since they're all flying. To the black shield. Barrier. Smash! Ugh. My barrier. Bam! In the face. Ooh! Knees in the stomach. Smack! Show him boss. Splitting from the mouth. Huh? Okay. Catch. Your wrist. Huh? He's getting him. Ooh! Headbutts him! Huh. Thud. He's down. Ugh. Steps on his face. Show Narlo who's boss. He's on his side. Fiona finds out about what happened here today. I'll dethrone you. Oh. Bonus. John. Okay. Defense trick high. Yeah, the same. So, depending on the ability he, I don't know, gets from someone else. His stats change. Huh. Chapter 57. Okay. Got blue hair. Arlo. 
I came here as fast as I could. <laughs> Both of them laid out. What's... Look at her. You're bleeding, Gunnar. And Ventus and Melee too. What in the world happened here? Elaine, calm down. Heal these two as best you can. I'll take them back once you're finished. Okay? He's not gonna tell her. Okay? She's telling them. I don't understand. These wounds. They would never fight each other. Were they fighting mirror images of themselves? Oh, he has a mirror, okay. And it would be being so horribly too. Even in Wilson, only a few could take on this duo. And Arlo. I've never seen him so badly injured before. Wilson or Wilson is number one in turf wars by a long shot. There isn't a single student in the entire region who can stand up to him except Serafina, but she's not around. So who could have done all this? Cough. Cough. Arlo, are you okay? Don't worry about me. Focus on healing those two. They're in much worse shape than I am. Uh, all right. Sam. Hey, Arlo. What is it? Uh, could you explain what led up to all this? He messed with the bull. Got his horns. How did he get so hurt? And why are you? It's best if you don't know. But Elaine he stands up. I want you to promise me you'll keep this whole incident a secret. Huh? Uh, okay. Something's really off about him. He seems pretty shaken. <laughs> I know Arlo. When someone as powerful as you shows worry, it frightens the rest of us. Ta -ta -ta -ta. You got John. His hands bloody. Dang. Uh, he's mad. First Claire. And now Arlo. Oh, he's mad. Where the heck is all the is all the work in this world? Throws his backpack. Huff, huff, huff. Oh! Serpent is there waiting at his door. Huh? John! Shocked. Uh, picks up his backpack. Fix it. Sarah! Long time no see. What? Is gonna think she's shaking. Drops his knees. Huh? Hey! She runs over. What happened to you? You're coming in blood. I. Think about that. <laughs> Slash. Bam. Smash. Stab. That's Arlo. Cop. Sarah. Please don't. Don't look at me right now. I'm so pathetic. Don't look at me. What's gone to you? Gone to him. The giant I know is strong and confident. But right now. Seems like he's broken to a thousand pieces. Okay. Come on, let's get inside. Grab the shoulder, standing. Okay, you can clean him up. What happened while I was gone? Okay, he's lying down. His shirt's still bloody. Huh. Okay, Elaine's calling. Uh oh. Episode 28. H Hello? Yes, Serafina? Okay, Serafina. She's not supposed to be back for another week. Uh, no problem. Uh, I'll be there as soon as I can. Click. Um, she wants me to go to her. Uh, will you be alright? I'm uh, fine. She wants him, she wants her to heal, uh, John up. Uh, okay, then see you tomorrow. But she's gonna know this, that John is all beaten up too. Wait, Elaine. Grabs her. Huh? Don't forget what you promised. Okay. She's in the kitchen. Getting ice cubes. Water. Okay. Comes over. <laughs> Puts water on the back of his neck. He's like, uh, oh shoot. Cold. What the? Ah, shoot. Grabs his arm. Hey, can you see I'm injured? Sits up. So she's gonna drink the water. Is right. Elaine will be here soon anyway. Plenty decided to say something. Water? She didn't have it. Oh, 
you drink, uh, you already drink most of it. Okay, you've been drinking anyways. So, what happened out there? Uh oh, uh, well, exactly what you expect, right? The school ace leaves and everyone targets her weak friend. No, that's not what we was asking about. I've never seen you break down like that before. After two weeks, the first thing you say to me is, don't look at me right now. That's not right. But I'm fine now, see? I just didn't expect you back so soon. Anyway, what about you? Where you been? You were online, and... Don't change the subject. Uh, what do you mean? I was worried that something had happened to you. You disappeared without saying anything. Ah, uh, my parents cut my internet. I convinced them to let me come back early. So I'm crashing your place. Now explain. Wait, she can't go to the dorm? Or because she's suspended, she's not supposed to be there? Hmm? Staring at him. He's looking away. I had enough of the bullying, alright? And I really didn't want you to come back to see me so defeated. But whatever. You're back now, so everything can go back to the way it was. Shocked? Huh. She can see between this. Ding dong. Ding dong. Okay, that's probably Lane. Okay. Oh, she's tired, Pant. And Pant. Sorry it took so long. I was hanging out with our uh, friend. It's fine. Come in. Uh, um, Serafina? I just wanted to, um, about the whole unordering thing. I'm so sorry. I had no idea things would get so bad. I really wasn't trying to get you into trouble, or in any trouble. I, I just didn't know what to do. There's no need to apologize. Huh? You didn't do anything wrong. So I'm stressed over it. Uh, okay. Close the door. She's happy. So what do you call me here for? Did she not know that's John's house? What's he doing here? Huh? Lady, I live here. Okay. She's getting... Oh, she's unpacking. Getting... What a loser. Okay. You're so lucky you're friends with Serafina. Otherwise, I'd never waste my precious energy on you. Always getting into fights you can't win. Uh... Get a clue already, hmm? Oh. Her aura seems much weaker than usual. She's already used a lot of energy to heal someone before this. Uh oh. Let me see your other arm. Avoiding? No, it's fine. I'll hit up at the doctor's tomorrow. You're kidding, right? I'm not going to leave the job that Seraphina gave me half finished. Okay, reaching? No, really, stop. Okay. Um, will you stay still already? Grabs his arm. I want to go home. Ouch. Okay. Okay, healing it. Is she not going to notice, like, the claws? His arm is completely shattered. Who did he peeve off this time? Hmm. This injury seems familiar. Why? And she notices. His wounds. Lily's claws. And Arlo's barrier. Uh-oh. But Elaine stands up. I want you to promise me you'll keep this whole incident a secret. Uh-oh. Uh, but he's a cripple. Oh, she's getting the sweats. There's no way. Uh-oh. That's impossible. And grabs her by the mouth. Grab. Uh-oh. Elaine. Shut up. She nods. Now. Listen carefully. Uh-oh. Sarah's coming back. Phew. Finally finished unpacking. Why she... Why she unpacking at his house? She's stretching, huh? Where'd Elaine go? She left. Oh, she just left. Some urgent came up. So she had to run. Hmm, weird. She left without saying goodbye. Uh-oh. Let's come out. Uh, she probably won't say anything. Like Serafina. Wow. So the three guy called in the principal's office and told to be careful. Um, did Ar Arlu didn't know that John was gonna ask to like hang out with him after school? 
How was that like preempted? But he lay out like his guard, let down his guard. I wonder if uh, Serafina is ever going to like find out about this. It's going to like change the whole dynamic of them. But now Arlo and uh, Ailey and um, the dude, they know all about this. Uh, so are they done picking him up, picking on him? I mean, Serafina is there, so yeah. Uh, that'd be like their cover. Like, Seraphine's there, so no one picks on uh, John anymore. Man. So he's like a mirror ability, or like, he copies other people's abilities. Man. So all those people that he just messed up, <laughs> he j he just reversed on them. Is it that they have to use their abilities on him or does he have to see it? Because, and how long does it last? Like, the distance between them. And how much time has to pass before it's like gone? Because he hasn't used any of the other kids' abilities. From when he just beat up the whole class. Um, wow. John's like, OP. No wonder you didn't want to, like, show people calling him monsters. He's like, no, you guys are monsters. He's being like, kept himself. He didn't, like, causing problems. People are like, Man, if only Arlo didn't just let things be. Just let him do what he does. And now this would have happened. Well, um, Serving is back at school, so, um, she's probably not gonna go back into the suspension lift. But why would she unpack at John's house? Like, just leave her like, suitcase. Just filled. Hmm. Well, um, that was a monster arc. <laughs> um, well, what are you guys' thoughts? Um, if you're new, subscribe, like, comment. Thanks for watching, and have a good rest of the day. Bye.